Hi everyone, and welcome back to part 10 of Nino Kuni. Um, we left off just heading to the library in Golden Paw to get some more information about the world in general to combat this mysterious threat. And at this point, I've lost count of how many threats there are. There's this mysterious labyrinth uh, wraiths guy, and then there's also the whole guy who's trying to steal all the king's bonds. Um, and there's also these mysterious doors um yeah so there's just a lot going on um a lot to keep track of but we are just heading into the library for now to get some more information it kind of gets overwhelming when there's so many different things happening at once but at the same time it's also pretty exciting because you don't run out of things to do. Hey there. Wait, where's the oh here. Welcome. I wonder, do I have to buy something in order for the chef to be able to make it? Because this let me see, what do I not own? Physical defense, fire damage strengthens, all attacks. Oh, that's expensive. This one boosts critical hit damage. Let's buy this. Come on, I don't know up. if it'll make a difference. Um, I don't know if it'll help the Floyd, that's his name, if it will help Floyd be able to cook more dishes or if he just has to level up over time. There was something that like I was able to do where I don't need to go back to Evermore each time, but how do I do that? Um, this is not it. Um, let me go back. Um, citizen. Wow, I can have 103 citizens. That's crazy. Okay, um... This is what I need. Um, assigning and leveling up, research. Okay, Evan can sit down, um, get to building. Are entirely separate from creating and building. Uh, so check back regularly and see how things are looking. You may also be able to earn extra by serving. Okay, you can also see how many can. Oh, okay. You have in the main menu. Okay, you can only see, but you still have to go back and collect. Okay. So let's go to the library. Mm -hmm. Feel free to look around Gold Paw. Okay. Let's head into the library. Look at this place! Look at this place! <laughs> Silence in the library! We'll have no rubberneckers here. You'll need the proper accreditation before I let you touch my bookie wookies, yes? <laughs> bookie wookies. <laughs> well, do you have a library card? Hmm? No library card, no bookie wookies. <laughs> and the only way to get one is from me. <laughs> Well, can you give us one? We need to look at those books. Need to? Hmm, desperate to get our greasy fingers on my bookie wookies, are we? Hmm, only mine will do. Hmm. <laughs> well, aren't we a cheeky one? But I like a cheeky one. Hmm, <laughs> yes. Please, you'd be doing us a huge favor. Hmm, what's this? Another cheeky one, and this one all little and adorable. Yes. Very well. Bodley will ask you three teeny weeny little favor wavery woos. Perhaps if you're lucky, I might let you touch my precious bookies after that. Just say the word when you're ready, yes? Yes. Okay, crazy lady. The trials of Bod Bodley. Three little favors, three little treats just for Bodley. Hee hee hee. Uh, first treat, first treat. I have a ravenous hankering for a red, red rose. 
so red, so pretty. Mm, yes, and they're only bloom once in ever such a long while. Luckily for you, there are some nearby. What the you want us to go flower picking for you? Flipman, talk about talk taking liberties. Why can't you go yourself, you wonky old heron dan? No, 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 awful creature, ignorant creature, I must stay and tend my darling bookies, yes? So where can we find this flower, Bodley? Leave Goldpaw and go north, north, but you can't walk there, no, it's at the top of a great big huge great cliff, oh yes. Oh, cliff? A cliff, Bodley said so, you'll need to be able to cast a bridge to get there, do you know it? Hmm. Yes, bridge, an easy PC magic trick for showing pathways where none else, where none were seen before. Crikey. That's a new one, Mun. Wouldn't even know where to begin if we wanted to research it back home, neither. You'll have to learn it, dear. There's no way around it. Would you like a teeny weeny hinty winty who on who can help you? Lil Lily, little Lily. She'll know what to do. Oh, yes, yes. Mm. Sounds like a local, but how are we supposed to convince a Goldpaw girl to come over our way, eh? Foolish creature. Evan is the savior of Goldpaw. A hero, yes, a wonder. Many want to join him now. Many, many, many. Alright, then let's go find out if Lily is willing to join us, shall we? Yes, and then you can bring me my lovely, lovely rose. Mmm, tee hee hee. Okay, crazy lady. Okay, let's. Can we explore anyway? The library has stood in gold paw since ancient times. Work is currently underway to excavate the lower levels in search of hidden troves of knowledge. The library is the perfect place to while away an idle moment or two, although I have read mo almost every work it contains, perhaps I will contribute a little something of my very own. Not that my future as a ce celebrated woman of words needs concern you. You have dream fragments to collect, nine of them to be precise. Oh yeah, she's the lady I gotta collect the dream fragments for. Okay, um, go and find Lily. Okay. I wonder if it's gonna be easy to find her. I think they're just gonna point me to the direction. Okay, gotta go north. What is this? Oh yes. Listen, PT, becoming a truly first-rate seamstress calls for more than mere dexterity with a needle. You see, the key to our craft is always consider the person who will wear the items we are creating. We must keep them in mind as we sew every stitch. Yes. Yes, Madame Yip Yip. I will be sure to bear this in. Oh my goodness. Oh. Is it, are you Evan? King Evan? Well, yes, but I, I'm really just a normal person like you. Normal? The savior of Goldpaw? Normal? You are a hero and the leader of a proud young nation. Wait, this is perfect. What do you think, Peachy? This could be the perfect opportunity for you to strike out on your own. <laughs> oh, Madam Yip, Yip, you are absolutely correct. What luck and what wonder wonderful Excuse timing. Me? I'm awfully sorry, but I'm afraid I have no idea what you're talking about. Gosh. Oh, I do apologize. We are forgetting ourselves. I am Yip, Yip and, I, and this is P Pai Chi. <laughs> Did I say Peachy? I like Peachy better. Um, I work as a seamstress here in Goldpot, and Pai Chi is my apprentice. I'm just gonna say Pai Chi. Uh, and I have recently decided to leave Madame Yip Yip's tutelage in order to find full-time work. Which is what we were discussing when, when you appeared. It is perfect, is it not? This is destiny, I'm sure of it. Is it true, King Evan? Is it true that your kingdom is in need of a skilled workers? If so, then I beg you to consider me. From from darning socks to tailoring suits, I have skill aplenty. Well, we'll always have need of new clothes, I suppose, and perhaps you could even help with making armor. Of course, we'd love to have you. Gosh! Haha, <laughs> your decisiveness is truly worthy of one of your station, King Evan. It is a great relief to know that my dear apprentice will be under your command. In that case, your majesty, I must ask for... ask you for the binding thread. The binding thread? What's that? It is tradition here in Goldpaw for an employer to give a seamstress a skein of thread to mark the commencement of her employment. The thread represents the bond between master and servant and it is said to ensure 
ensure undenying loyalty. This custom is of great importance to us, King Evan. No self-respecting seamstress would start working for a new master without a binding thread. <laughs> I I see. Yes. And I would appreciate it very much if the thread you gave me could be grass green in color. All right. Of course, leave it to me, Paichi. I shall bring you some grass green thread right away. Wonderful, I will be waiting your return. So, Paichi's training as a seamstress is at an end, so get some spools of green grass thread. Okay, um, nimble fingers. So, do I know where I can get this? Should I make this my active quest? No. Oh, there's a lot of people I can talk to. Mm, okay, let's do all the side quests first. Evan, oh Evan, thank goodness you're alright. Persha, Persha, what are you doing here? Yeah. Well, you know, things got rather hairy back at the castle. I had to persuade a young man to hide me in his cart so that I could escape. The next thing I knew, here I was. Gosh, well, it's a relief to see that you're safe anyway. Yes. Oh yes, they're taking very good care of me here, you know? This is my first experience of life in another kingdom, but it seems some things are the same wherever you go. As long as you're willing to work for a living, you can't go far wrong. That's wonderful to hear. By the way, I've started a new kingdom of my own. Would you like to come and join us there? Huh? Gosh, are you sure? I mean, it's a wonderful offer, but I do have a job here. <laughs> ar har har, don't be silly, Persia. The king himself has come to fetch you. I shall be sorry to see you go, but how could I possibly stop you? Hmm? But there is one last thing I would like you to do for me before you go. Could I ask you to sew a new quilt for one of the guest rooms? I would be happy to, of course, but we're all out of thread. Oh dear. Right. I can go and get you some thread, Persia. Thanks. Could you? Oh, that would be such a great help. Four clumps of green glade cotton would be just perfect. Give the four clumps of green glade. Okay. Sure. Yes. Bring me four clumps of green glade cotton, would you, my dear? Oh, I've got once I've got that, I can finish the quilt and come to your kingdom. Here you go, Prisha. I bought you four clumps of green glade cotton, just like you asked. Thank you. Really? You did that for me? Oh, aren't you wonderful? I shall pay you back 100 fold when I come to your kingdom. Now, let me just sew this quilt and I'll be ready to leave. How fast can you sew? Thanks. Excellent. Now I will be able to continue keeping my esteemed customers in the comfort to which they have become accustomed. <laughs> Thank you for all your hard work, Prisha. Ah, her heart. May fortune favor you and your new home. Yes. Thank you, too. I don't know what I would have done without your kindness. Okay, cool. Made sense. An easy charm and eye for deal that can boost the bazaar's productivity. Okay, perfect. So let's continue on. I don't know where I'm supposed to get this thread from. Um, hold on, let me see. Quests. So the labyrinth, we're not gonna do that right now. Get some spools of grass green thread. Um, that's not what I wanted. Uh, acquired and thriving bazaar. Okay, um, top marks. And those are the dream fragments. Okay, well I can't really... Can't really do those things right now. Okay. Bizarre, bizarre. Have I gone to a bizarre? Can't remember. Excuse me. Excuse me, may I ask you something? I'm looking for the one called Golden Warrior. Do you know perhaps who he is? Freaky. Freaky, that's a name and a half. I don't think I've ever heard of it before, mind. Is there anything else you could tell us about this warrior character? Yes. 
They say he is a true leader of men and that he has blonde hair and a pointy ear. Blonde hair and pointy ears, eh? Remind me of you of anyone, Evan, my lad. Wait, that sounds like me. Oh, you are younger than I expected, but now that you mention it, you do match the description. But I've never been called the Golden Warrior or anything like that. Are you sure you aren't? Golden Warrior, please, please come and save us. Crikey, she's proper pleading with you. Mun sounds to me like she's in a right pickle. Yes, right. Well, I'm sure we'll be able to help you, miss. Can you tell us the whole story from the beginning? So you will come and save us? Oh, thank you, thank you so much. My name is Hoi Dan. I live here in Gold Pond, a quiet area away from all the hustle and bustle. It is always a peaceful place to live, until recently, that is. Now it is being terrorized by a horrible monster. What is more, most of the adults who live there work in other parts of the kingdom. Only children and old people remain, and they cannot hope to defend themselves. I was sent out to find someone, anyone, who could assist us in our hour of need, and I have found you. Please, you must come and help us. Why do you reckon Evan? I don't fancy her chances if she's waiting for this golden warrior bloke to come and help her. You're right, Lofty. Well, there's one thing for it. We're going to step into the breach. Don't worry, miss. We'll take care of this. Oh, thank you. The monsters always run off after it has had its fun rampaging through our neighborhood. We believe it's looking down in Tight Fight Cavern near the Heartlands. Tight Fit. Tight Fit Cavern? Alright. We'll go and deal with it. You wait here, Hoyden. Defeat a Mortimer in Tight Fit Cavern. Recommended level 29. Don't think I can do this right now. Um, okay, is there any other side quests to do? Yes, let's go back down. I like when I'm able to jump off of buildings. Unfortunately, that is not the case for everything. So I gotta head back south. Let's go this way. Oh, I can't buy a thread from here. A bazaar, where did I see a bazaar? Or where did I encounter one that I can get this thread from? Um, where am I going? That is not the direction I need to be going. Hold on. I passed it. Oh, this is the swift solutions. Welcome. Welcome to the Iron Orchid Outfitters. What can I do for you today? Oh, is this where I can buy stuff? Oh, well, I don't need anything for you. Boots are good. I can use new boots. I can actually give them to... Hangs on with 1 HP after a big hit. Boosts damage done by sword slightly. Boosts fire resistance. Um, yeah, let's give it to you. Take your time. Oops. Mm, yeah, and I don't need anything Take else. Your time. Maybe I can sell some stuff.
Take your time. Come back anytime. Okay. Oh, wait, what am I going? If you require weapons, please speak with the shopkeeper. I cannot help you. Come now, newbie. Surely it is time for you to try making your first weapon at last. You're a weapon maker? That's wonderful. Well, my training is not yet complete. My grandmother was a weapon maker, you see, and I was her apprentice until she passed away. I should find a new master, but I do not have the enthusiasm. The shopkeeper here has taken me under his wing, but in truth, I am worthless. That's terrible. I understand how hard it must be for you. But I'm sure your grandmother would have wanted you to continue your studies and become a weapon maker like her. In fact, why don't you come to my kingdom so you can do just that? Oh, yes. Well, well, newbie, this is an interesting offer. What do you think? Would you like to go to this kind young man's kingdom? Hmm. Yes, yes, I think I would. But there is a favor I would like to ask of you first. My grandmother loved nothing more than to see her weapon used in the defeat of a ferocious monster, but there is one monster she never saw beaten, though she always dreamed of it. I think it would help her rest in peace if this monster were eliminated. Mm. I'm sure that's something we can help you with. The beast is known as Mag... Manimus. It roams the lands near this kingdom. Please, you must see that it is defeated at last. Okay. Magmanimus. Ah, uh, level 28. Okay. Okay. So I think those are all the side quests for now. Um, local teleport? Okay. Maybe we should get the main story out of the way, because we're I think we're way too underleveled regardless, so... Um, actually, let me just... Whoops, that's not what I wanted. If you're not happy with how you've used your battle points thus far, you can always spend a few kinks builders to reset them and see if another setup suits you better. That's not what I wanted. Um, let me go back to side quest. <sighs> Defeat Mortimer and Tight Fit Canyon. Okay, yeah. Also, oh, these are showing you that you can get um people for that. Okay. So where am I going? Oh, just gotta go up here. Okay, let me just save it. Yes, I have been waiting for you. My name is Lily. 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 Anyway, Bodley has told me a great deal about you. Gosh. You're a Lily? Gosh, I must say, I expected you to be a little older. When Bodley said you were an expert on magic, I thought you must be a grown-up. You of all people should be aware of what we children are capable of in. Indeed, I would say that we are far more capable than most adults. The truth is, I have become delusioned with life here in Gold Probably. The trick dice, the sham trial, I always had so much respect for Master Pugnacious, I could not believe it when I learned of his deceptions. But it wasn't really his fault, Lily, he was being manipulated. Yeah. I know that, but still, I cannot forget. Things just do not feel the same here anymore. Mm -hmm. So that's why old Bodley sent us to see you, eh? Very crafty, man, very crafty. She wants us to invite you over to our kingdom, ain't it? What do you say, Lily? Sounds like a change of scenery would do you the power of good. Yes, I think it might, and after all, Evan, it was you who exposed Master Pugnacious' wicked deeds. You have a good heart. You are a leader I could follow. Well then, let's... All I ask is that you defeat three skeptoplasm... skeletoplasms, then I will gladly join you. What the? Hang on a flippin' second, where are all these monster hunt and talk coming from all of a sudden? I cannot risk following a new leader only to be let down once again. Make this promise for me, Evan, please. Okay, level 17. So we can go and do that. Make this your main quest? Sure. 
go defeat oh no that's not what I wanted go back down go down right here okay so we just gotta find some skeleplasms oh there's one right there what is that? Oh, is that just showing me the range of where these enemies are? So if there's two here, do you think that counts as two or just one? Ooh, I leveled up! That's perfect, that's just what I needed! Oh, yep, that's two, so we just need to defeat one more. And there's one right here, perfect! This these hunting quests would be easy if it's like, oh, defeat ten of these, it's like... As long as you're in the right area, one battle will have so many of them. Yay, victory! Who leveled up, I wonder? Okay, so let's go back to Gold Paw. I like that you can pick like specifically where you want to teleport to in the city, so that saves so much time. <laughs> So much time. And especially with all these side quests, I can imagine you running around the whole world, literally trying to complete these quests. So being able to teleport not only to exactly where you need to go, the city, but as well as like the area in that city, because these cities are pretty big. And also like, um, I was going to say something, yo that dog is just staring at me. Um. Yeah, and the fact that it tells you which quests are complete makes it so much easier. Well, Lily, we did it! We took care of those monsters! What? You don't believe us, Flippin' Heckman? What do you want to take us for? <laughs> Fear not! I knew from the very start that you would not fail me. The stars had foretold it. Evan, you have proven that you are a man of your word. It is now time for me to keep my promise and join you in your kingdom. That's wonderful, Lily. Okay, but she needs to teach me the spell. Mind for magic that's perfect fit for both the spell works and the dispellery. Now, I believe you require my assistance in learning the spell known as Bridge. I must warn you, it is not easy piece of spellcraft to master. I will not be able to teach it to you here and now. Oh, you don't have to do it here, Lily. We have a wonderful magical research facility back in Evermore. I was hoping you'd be able to come back there and help us. Ah, oh, well, in that case, all should be well. In a well-appointed facility, the process will not take long at all. Ah, oh, there, there, there's fabulous. Let's head back over there and get our magic making caps on then, eh? Our researchers will have their... What? I've got their noggins around the bridge spell before you know it, man. Thanks to Lily Magical Expertise, you can now learn bridge at Evermore Spellworks. Perfect. So, let's go and do that. Um... I should check out the other towns though to see what other side quests um, need to be taken into account. Okay. So citizens... So none of these are ready to be leveled up, but we got Persia, so the Bazaar and- Oh, Bazaar Productivity! That's where I can get the thread from. And spell works. so... Um, research. I think the research is done. 100%, yes. Complete research. Okay, and then this research is also done.
Okay, so... Let's see, um... So... That uses that up experience earned. Detailed descriptions of Higgledy Biology that helps reduce cook-up costs by 20%. Yes. Okay, uh, let's see where we can put the bazaar. Because I want to build that. If I can. Uh, let's see, where is it? That's the fish market. Oh, the humble bazaar. Here we go. Let's build that. It's good to build the things when you need them because then it, it's easier to keep track of. Okay. So we can assign Prisha. So she is perfect for that. Okay, and then the Evermore spells work. Personnel, Lily, research, so level one spell development. More basic spells, efficient spell, uh, reducing cost by 20%, specific spell development, bridge. Research the into the use of bridge spell that reveals hidden pathways. Okay. So that'll take like a minute. Um, general store. Uh, let me see here. The hunting lodge and the ranch. I could research this. Um, you know what? I let me. Yeah, let me um remove you guys. Right. So the hunting lodge is here. So Batu is the best suitable for that. And then the ranch. Was it the ranch? Let me see. Um Yeah, the ranch is productivity. Hey. Yeah, so we can build the ranch here. There, at least we have everybody like where they need to be. And level it up, but we don't want to level it up right now, so... But this one... I want to research more. Higgledy Stone Hunter. I want to level up Kungish. Or possibly recruit more people. So... Let's go to the bazaar now. Oh dearie me, I seem to have nodded off. How embarrassing. Well, here's a little gift for you. I'd appreciate it this little episode stayed between you and me. Snow white thread. Okay, but I need green yeah. thread. I'm making sure the washing is hung in exactly the right place to take advantage of the sunshine. There's nothing like fresh sheets that have been dried outside. Yes. My routine is the same as it was in Ding Dong Dell. Are you ready to order? Hello, Your Majesty. What can I wrestle you up today? Still Take no new time. recipes? Let me see ya! Oh my gosh, no. I Are wanna learn to more. Yes. I offer very unique service. You see, unlike restaurants and cooking for other ingredients my customers bring me, and the recipes I cook are guaranteed to bring out the best in their ingredients, be it the ability to heal or to make you stronger or more intelligent. So if you ever come across an interesting recipe or some unusual ingredients on your travels, bring them to me and I'll be more than happy to cook them up for you, all free of charge naturally, of course. I'll 
I'm still relatively new compared to the cooking scene, so I'll only be able to make a few things at first. But the more I cook different recipes from around the world, the more my culinary skills will increase. And one day, I'm hoping that no dish will be beyond me. Oh, and I picked up a recipe for you. You'll be able to pay a few guilders. Yeah. Okay. Take your time. So. Use the ingredients you've gathered to cook delicious dishes. Cookery level one. How many do I need to cook though? In order for him to level up. Take your time. See ya. Okay, I don't want to waste too much on that. If we were to develop the bridge spell, you will need to give an order to the research to begin. Your Majesty Roland will be there to learn more. Um. Oh, I can level up his skills, his spells. I can level up her spell as well. Um, I will leave it for now. Um, Hello there. Um, okay, nurture Higgledees. There's no point in leveling them up if I don't need to. But I can make this now. Let me see what the abilities are. Uh, slightly increases an ally's magical defense. Temporarily creates a field that boosts resistance to dark element attacks. Makes the player more resistant to dark element attacks when awakened. I mean, I could make it, right? Like, there's no downside to making it now. I have enough items. Let's just do it. I don't have to equip you, but I'll just... Recruit you. <laughs> Life says well as fits Sky Pirate, but the kingdom's building lark ain't none too bad either. Ah, while I'm here, just a little something I found the other day. Thought you might like it. Oh, I got a bone. Interesting. So you can still talk to people and get items. Listen. Listen. Okay, so these barracks, I need to like figure it out. Yeah. Come to do some shopping, eh? Hmm. I don't think I need anything from here. Oh wait, let me see if I can buy the thread from here. Do you think so? Oh, uh, maybe not. Oh. No, they don't have the green thread. Huh. They don't have the green thread that I need. What else can I do? I'll Just be my luck. Again, then. Okay, um, let's go back here. Hey. Facilities. Okay. Complete research. Thank you. Thank you so much for finding out how to cast bridge, Lily. Now we can make pathways wherever we want. No, no, Master Evan, you misunderstand. Not simply anywhere. The spell uncovers hidden pathways It does not create them. You must find a place where it seems a path should be, and you must cast it there. Have you ever stood somewhere and thought, where is this path? Is it missing? You must seek out such a place. Oh, that's not how I thought it worked at all. Ah, but you did not need the spell in order to help Mistress Bodley. She is not someone that I would choose to keep waiting. Gosh. Gosh, you're right. We'd better go and find that rose for her. Thank you, Lily. The rolling hills are home to all manner of marvelous fauna and flora, but this is one of my very favorites, Mogwamp. 
It's so nice and colorful that it never fails to cheer me up. It's always been much loved by the children of Ding Dong Dell. It's one of my favorites too. I love picking Maguam when I was a child. I never have I've never seen that plant in my life. Myself. Is this it is delightful, is it not? Take a look at the photograph. A friend and I decided to test our courage and enter a cavern known as Death's Door. I took this picture to prove we had really been there and was amazed to see the spe spectral presence behind us. Could it have been a real ghost? Gosh, there really is something there. That is no ghost. It is a trick of the light. That cave is known to be haunted. This is the scene I came upon when wandering in the woods. See how the tree's roots have grown to form natural arches, tempting the intrepid explorer to pass through them and go deeper in the forest? Did I follow that trail or turn back? What do you think? There's such an atmospheric that's such an atmospheric scene. I long to explore a forest like that. I will follow the path and see where it led. I would love to hang this picture on my wall. Okay. Let us collect hey. this. And let's see if we have anything else. Uh dinky eggs. Can we sell it? Oh, seven guilders? No, not worth it. I'll take all. Okay. So let us... I kinda wanna go to... Where was it? Sky Pirate's base? Let's see if there's any like side quests or like people I can recruit from the Pirate's Den. Cause if we could recruit people from Cloud Coil... Ah, uh, from Goldpaw. Yep, see? There is one person I can recruit. Oh, uh... oh King Evan, fancy seeing you here. <laughs> I'm ever so sorry, just uh, but I can't seem to recall your name. Yeah. Well, well the name's uh, Manokoi, Your Majesty, and well, you see, that is. Oh, why did you just run away? Dash it all, tis no good. I can't stay to bring myself to say it. Oh. Wait, come back. I wonder what that was all about. Why the hell did he run away? What? Feel for fruit, a deep love for the land and can boost the farm's productivity. Oh, look at all the higgledies around here. These weren't here earlier, right? Is there anyone else here that I have a side quest for? No. Right. Oops, I can't go there. Oh. Bro. Did you follow me here? As a matter of fact, I did. I was worried af about you after you ran off like that, so I decided to come and see what was wrong. Y you were worried about me? Yes. Yes, and it seems as if you had something you want to get off your chest. If you don't mind telling me, I'm, I'm happy to listen. I is that so now? Er, uh, then I suppose I might... Oh, God. Ugh, oh, what am I saying? There ain't no way I can ask you such a thing. I'd go red as a blessed beetroot. He ran off again. Right when he was about to tell us what was wrong, we better go after him. He's just gonna be like, Can I join your kingdom? And then Evan's gonna be like, Yeah, of course. Okay, where the heck did he go? Got me running around this whole base. Got nothing else interesting to do. Ah, you tracked me down again? Do you mean to chase me to the end of the world, Curse ye. I mean to chase you until you tell me what's wrong. If you don't want me to make make me curious, you shouldn't keep running off like that. Ah, uh, well, you see, the truth is... Yes? I was wondering if you might see your way allowing me to well... What? Allowing you to what? And he runs off. Great. No, 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 I can't. I just can't. I'm a lily-livered, yellow-bellied coward. And this ain't no remedy for it. Leave me, curse you. Where's he gone now? I can't just let him go. I have to find out what's bothering him.
Um, All right, Manokoi, this is it. No more running away. <sighs> Miss Tanny, don't tell me you're after me as well. Car, I don't. I know better than to try and run from one so fierce as yourself. Seems the jig is up. Please, Manokoi, will you just tell us what's on your mind? We just want to know what you wanted to ask. That's all. All right, all right, Kirsty, I'll come clean. Yeah. Too right, you will. Come on, spit it out. Well, the truth is, I wanted to ask if ye might permit me to, well, to... To what, Minokoi? So... It's always been a dream of mine, you see, to... To to grow the prettiest little vegetables patch in all the world. A vegetable patch? Oi. I, the very same. See, I ain't blessed with some uh, kind of talent, so... Me fellow sky parents, not the flying skills of Kunbish, nor the brawn of Ching... Chingis, neither. As a sky parrot, I'm a third weight swab at best, and since I can't be of much use here, I thought I might do a little something to help you in your new kingdom instead. And well, what with me dream and all, I thought I might kill two birds with one stone, as it were. So you want to come and grow vegetables for us? Or exactly, I thought it would grow a few turnips and the like. It'd be a fine way of making myself useful. Mm. That would be wonderful. Come and grow as many vegetables as you like. Thank you very much. You truly mean it, your majesty. Or you've made an old pirate happy, so ye have. I'll away and start digging right this minute. I'll pour my heart and soul into that there soil. You'll see. Aww. So sweet. Okay, so I'm glad he did we went and did that um and i think that is all for now so uh what is that oh that's the rose that's where we gotta go for to get the rose okay so yeah so she said head north I saw a sparkly light and I was going towards Come it. What is that? Oh, a squirmish area. Okay. Leave this to me. The question is, how do I get over there? Um. Okay. I am not on the right stretch of road where I need to be. 
Uh, that's mildly frustrating because I don't know how to get over there. Okay, let's see. I tried to take a shortcut to run away from it, but it did not work. Way. Mega Moo, Mega Moo, Magma Goo, that's what it's called, not Mega Moo. Um, what's this called? The Manticore, that's not what I have to battle. But I should battle it. I kinda want to battle it. Level 16, I can beat you. You look dangerous, but you should be fine. Pretty simple, pretty simple. Got some good items there. A bottle of fresh milk. Okay, not bad, not bad. Okay, so we gotta head over here. Right? Wrong. I gotta get on that. How do I get on that? Wait, should I just... Take my chances this way. Is there a way to get up there? How do I get up there? Wait, so you're telling me? No. Oh. I gotta walk around there. This is so annoying. Wait, what? No, wait, what? Oh my gosh. This place is so confusing. Confusion, confusion. All around confusion. Okay, I go here. Right, and then I just continue following this path, and then okay, I have to go that way, but I want to go this way. Why is there sparklies here? I will fight you, it's okay. Watch your back. When you're fighting something close rank like this, it's hard to get to your Higgledies to try and use their abilities, you know what I mean? Unless, like, you stay behind and retreat, but I like to just get things done pretty quickly. Let's see if we can equip this. 
Twangy slippers boosts damage done by bows. Perfect for um Tanny. Silk slippers. Okay. And you've got yourself a pair of silk slippers. This is a better bow. Nah, not really. Um, spear, I mean, not bow. Um. Let me see. The jade. Cantana. Yeah, we can. Yeah. Um. And there's nothing better for you there. Nothing better for you there. Let's see this. Um. 46, this one. Yeah. Okay, perfect. We've upgraded our equipment. Kinda wanna see how far this goes. Level 12? Doesn't seem that strong. You ready for this? <laughs> A dollop of earthly sap. Okay, so where am I on the map? Did I not explore this area? I wonder if there's like a trap door somewhere here so that I can teleport next time. Oh yeah, that's where the forest is. I guess I just didn't come in this... on this side. Okay, I think I got a new wand for Evan. Whoops. What am I doing here? Oh no. The wand I have is still the better wand. Level 21 pork chopper? Should I try it? Let me save it before I die. I think Tanny's level 21. Yeah, level 21, 22. Let's try it. Let us try it. And this time I'll use my Higgledies to try and keep What's some distance. This? important thing is that I did not die. So we can use one of these. I like that I don't have to use these items very often, you know what I mean? I can't wait to be able to get enough research points and IQ to be able to run faster. Like, I need that. <laughs> this is becoming a pain. I'll do my best. <laughs> Ooh, 
a feisty short bow. Let's see. Oh no. Still a weak weapon. Man, I can't outrun that. It's huge. So I don't have to worry about my friends fighting like they are able to fend for themselves. The place where Bodily said the rose would be is just beyond here, isn't it? That's right, man. That is my boy, and if we've ever stood somewhere and thought where the flippin' path is, it's flippin' missing. It's by your... You're right. There's a wonderful fish known as a stuck-up sturgeon. You see how its nose points up in the air as if it thinks itself superior to other fish? It always makes me laugh because it's such a silly expression, but it's best not to mock it. Its mouth is full of sharp teeth. How large is it? It can grow to be a couple yards long. Wow, that's amazing indeed. It's very impressive fish indeed. Why did that post come up suddenly? Big piggy longsword. I don't think I I am enough levels for this. Level sixteen. No. Um. Let me see if I can give this sword. <gasps> Ooh, that's a strong sword. Pickle D balls heals HP a little. Slight damage boost versus dragons. Okay. And this is slight increased fire damage. Huge damage boost versus dragons. Okay. Cool. So, this is a red, red rose. I reckon so, yeah. Let's get it back to Bodley before she throws a proper stoop, shall we? Stoop? Whatever, I don't even know what she said. Or what he said. Um, let's just go straight to Gold Paw. Oh wow, we're reaching the hour mark again. Or while well, we're at, like, above the hour mark. These videos cannot be an hour long, like, there's just too much to do, too much to explore, that an hour is not long enough. Well, let's just finish this part of the quest and we can continue it on in the next video. Well, did you find the red red rose for your bodily wadly woo? The, the the speech in here is funny. Yes, this is it, this is it. Wonderful, magical, and beautiful. So red, so red, almost too red. This is what Bodley wanted, just what Bodley wanted. Oh, Evan dear, you are a lovely boy, a special boy, yes. Bodley hasn't been so happy in oh centuries.
<laughs> now it's time for you to do me my second little favorite wavery woo. Now it's time for you to do me my second little favorite wavery woo. It will be dangerous, yes, very dangerous. Ooh. Have you heard of in raptors, fiery, wiry, horrible hot dragons, horrible. Mm, I want an incineraptor's horn. Yes, it's horny, warny, woo. Okay. <laughs> and you know what you'll need to do to get it, don't you? Yes, you'll have to hit one. Heard it, beat it black and blue. <laughs> Them's the lousy lizards as makes their home over Cloud Cloud Canyon's way. Or we know where to find them well enough and we know where how to steer well clear. The fiends will burn you to a crisp suit. As soon as you look at ye. Whoa. Noisy man, nasty man, stupid, cowardly, hairy man, use a watery spell. Yes, kills them just like that. Yes, simple. Huh. Exploit their weakness, huh? Yeah, that makes sense. I think we might be able to develop something along those lines back home. Why don't we give it a shot? Don't care what you do, but bring it. Yes, bring me a horny, 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 woo. Here, present for you. A secret supplement. What is this? Don't know what it is, but you'll need it. Bodily can tell. Hmm. All natural, all wonderful, all powerful serum for silky smooth skin and nourishing nutritional niceness. Bodily special secret supplement, yes. You'll know what you need it when you need it, dear. You'll know hmm. when the time is right, yes. Uh, sure, the time to do what exactly? Yeah, um, I'm sure we'll work it out. Alright, let's away and beg us one of those scaly swabs. I- scaly swabs. I know the way well enough. Follow me, you dogsy. Okay. Man, this can't be good for my health. I'm at my desk at the end of another 16 hour shift, eating yet another takeout meal. Don't get me wrong, it'll all be worth it once the perpetual fission reactor is done. I'm just worried I won't live to see it. I can- I hear you. I practically live in the office, right? I've forgotten what a weekend even is. Pro pickup tip for guys. The other day I decided I would unleash my woolly charms on Min T. I attempted to strike up a conversation, but she cut me dead with a single glance. Now I cannot stop thinking about her. Like a true huntress, it seems she's captured my heart. You spoke to her, you are braver than me. If you don't try, you'll never get anywhere. Yes, yes, you don't have to tell me that. Okay. Um, so... We can look for that um, in the next video. I just want to see. She doesn't know any water spells. He has water balloon, which I can switch for fireball. Um, that would be easier. And then he doesn't have any water either. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Yeah, so... Okay, he can use water, and I do have the... Water... The water one here, which is the only water one I have, so... That will have to do... Cool, so now Tanny's on the same level as those guys, and I think... I'll keep her with the experience boost items. I think go and find an incinerator after. Yeah. Um let me just head back to Evermore and I will Collect what I need to collect and see if I can upgrade the spells. Uh, let me yes. see. <laughs> yes. Oh, fresh wonder water. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Let's upgrade the water balloon since we can. What is this? When water balloon becomes level 5? Okay. Okay, so water balloon has been improved. Um, Come to do some 
shopping, eh? I'll be seeing you again then. Let's see if we can collect some more yeah. items. No. Are you ready to order? No Take your time. Items see ya. To be cooked. <laughs> okay. So let's manage huh. some stuff here. Didn't get the thread yet either. Um, okay, so he will do good for the farm. But let's see if we can add him to the exploration guild. Okay. Thirty-five. Okay, well we have a 125 total now, so let's see what we can research. Well, we can do improve smash and grab, um, we can do the brisk stroll, and the higgledy stone visible on the mini-map. Okay, that will take 67 minutes, and this will take 58 minutes. Okay, I kind of want to do this one, so... We'll get that out of the way. Let's see if we can upgrade... Um, wait. Expand coffers. Your coffers will be able to hold up to that much. Level up kingdom. Territory expands and new facilities become available. Huh. Store capacity level 1, 5,000, 25 or more citizens. Oh, well, I don't- I need more than- I need more, um... Oh, research has completed here. Research for cook great higgledies for us has been completed. Um, okay, might as well do this. Level of facility. New materials produce an extra personnel slots. Oh, wait, let me see. A really general store. Fresh fish market. Okay, um. Oh, they don't have the green. What I need. Um. New materials produced and extra personnel slots. Might as well level it up. Let's see what items can be claimed now. Oh, lemon yellow. No, I need green grass. Ah, oh, okay, that's fine. Uh, level up, big boost in influence, new kingdom level two. Go research. Efficient spell development on research magic, efficiently reducing cost by 20%. That's 70 minutes. This one is 25 minutes. I feel like 70 minutes will fly by eventually. How do I increase my stores though?
Oh, expand your stores. Oh, store more stuff. Here, 150. Okay. Yeah, I need... I need that. But I can level up the facility. Improved forging techniques enables valuable objects to be more easily spotted and recovered on land. lot of these things so but they're gonna be able to level up soon I think so hey okay so yeah I think that's good for now um while those research is taking place... Oh, um, who do I exchange? <laughs> oh, I think it was Nile. To exchange those items for guilders. I think everybody with that, um, I've talked to. Oh, look at the cute sheep. Okay. I think I am going to pause this Thanks. now. Snake Tooth Ridge, we're just gonna teleport there and then... We will pause this gameplay video. Okay, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. For more Nino Kuni gameplay videos, I am also doing Life is Strange if you're new to my channel. And check out... Um, I have some other art videos as well. And I will be doing more gameplay videos in the future. I will try to be doing Pokemon and Fire Emblem as well. Uh, Fire Emblem will be a randomly generated run. So that will be super interesting if you're into that. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for sticking around and for watching. Don't forget to click the like and subscribe button. And until next time, thank you guys. Bye.